tonight, Conley ISD is mourning the loss of one of its students who died from COVID-19. Yeah, this marks the fourth COVID death for the district this school year. Six News reporter Maria Aguilera tells us how the community is reflecting on his memory. Chris Leslie Connolly ISD has been hit hard by COVID-19, but this loss is hitting them especially hard. George Morales, a 10th grade student at Connolly ISD, lost his battle to COVID-19 this week. His mom, who's a staff member at the district, shared a post on Facebook that said he died surrounded by family and close friends. It is one of their friends. It's someone that they hung out with. Jill Bottleberg, the district assistant superintendent, says this is especially hard on their students since he was so well known. George is just one of those students that everyone loved. He had a very infectious smile. Um, he would go out of his way to, to be kind or to make sure that he said hello to you. Um, and, and he was just involved in a lot of things. Morales battled COVID-19 for more than a month. There's definitely a, an overall sadness uh, that you could see it in people's eyes. He was one of Ray Matherm's students no, in the JROTC program. Matherm remembers him as someone with a kind heart, always smiling. One of those special kids uh, where no matter how terrible your day was, when, you, when, he, when he came up to you, uh, your worst day, he always put a smile on your face. Connolly ISD is a small but tight-knit community, and they're all grieving as Morales' life was cut short. In this time where, where, where social media and other things, people being very hateful, George was, was that one that we can always turn to, to to show each other love, even perfect strangers. The district is asking for prayers for his family at this time. Maria Aguilera, 6 News, back to you. And the district says counselors are available at all campuses for students and staff.